Hi, I'm Dan Belmont. We're here at Murray's Cheese on Bleecker Street in Manhattan, and today we're building the perfect cheese board. If your cheese board is part of a larger meal, you want two ounces of cheese per guest. If your cheese board is the main event, we want one ounce of each cheese with a minimum of four cheeses. That's a great place to start. Today, we're starting with a young, fresh cheese with lactic notes, bright acidity, grass, lemon, beautiful, clean flavors. From there, we go into a more mature cheese with a fudgy texture and a washed rind. Next, we have cheddar, always a crowd pleaser, nutty and sweet, with notes of brown butter and caramel, an aged cheddar is a perfect complement to this plate. Next, we're working with a more mature cheese with a firm texture and good salt. These cheeses pair wonderfully with nice, sweet complements. Lastly, we have Big Bad Blue. Blue cheese has strong, assertive mold with a nice, peppery bite. It's a great way to finish off a cheese plate. Complete the plate with a small jar of honey, some dried fruit, and you're set to party. To recap, when building a perfect cheese board, the overarching theme is balance. You wanna start with a lightly aged cheese, work your way into more assertive flavors, and finish with something strong like a blue. I'm Dan Belmont, this is Murray's Cheese, and you're watching Playboy.com. This week we're looking at a wine from the village of Morgon, which is uh, in the southern portion of the Burgundy region in France. It's actually the area known as...